Hi everyone! Welcome back to my channel. As requested by some of our viewers to have also AutoCAD 3D tutorials, we will be shifting into 3D. Before we draw in 3D, I would like to give important points on how to manage 3D drawing area. First is the environment. As you can see, we are in 2D environment. The tools that we are seeing in the ribbon are only for 2D. So we need to switch it into 3D workspace. To do that, just go here in the status bar and click the workspace switching, the setting logo. Then choose any of these two, 3D basics or 3D modeling. So let's select 3D modeling. So we can already see here the tools that we usually use for 3D drawing. Next is the 2D and 3D UCS axis. Sa 2D, mayroon lang dalawang axis. Ang x-axis at ang y-axis, which is the width and the length. At sa top view, lang tayo nag-drawing. Sa 3D naman, mayroong tatlong axis. Ang x-axis, which is the width, ang y-axis, which is the length, at ang z-axis, which is the height. Ngayon, ituturo ko muna sa inyo kung paano i-view sa top, sa front, sa left, sa right, sa back, and bottom. Gamit itong pinipare kong drawing na nilagyan ko ng pangalan. So, una, para pumunta sa front, type negative B, enter, F, Enter. So, this is the front view. Next, para pumunta sa left, type negative V, enter, L, enter. So, this is the left view. Next, para pumunta sa right, type negative B, enter, R, I, enter. So, this is the right view. Next, para pumunta sa back, type negative V, enter, B, A, enter. So, this is our back view. Next, sa bottom naman, type negative V, enter, B, enter. So, this is our bottom view. At para ma-view on three sides, just type negative V, enter, S, E, enter. So, this is the southeast view. At para bumalik sa top, just type negative V, enter, T, enter. Sa 2D, dito lang tayo nag-drawing sa top view. Kung mas prefer nyo namang itik lang yung command instead of typing it, ay meron din tayong view control dito sa upper left ng drawing area. I-click lang natin dito sa view control, meron ditong bottom. And left. And right. And front and back and other isometric views gaya ng southeast view dito rin sa upper right ng ating drawing area ay mayroong 
view cube. Pwede rin natin itong gamitin para ma-view yung different sides ng drawing. I-click lang natin itong top side ng cube para pumunta sa top. Or, i-click lang natin itong arrow sa gilid kung gusto natin pumunta ng front, bottom, back, right, or left, at bumalik sa top. At kung mapapansin nyo, pag tinapat natin yung cursor sa view cube, ay lalabas itong dalawang arrows. Ginagamit ito para irritate ang drawing area. Take note, hindi ito pang rotate ng drawing kundi mismong drawing area. At kapag wala ito sa drawing area, pwede natin siyang i-on. Punta lang tayo sa View, then click View Cube para lumabas siya sa Drawing Area. Next, meron din tayong navigation bar dito sa right side. Under this, meron tayong full navigation wheel. I-click natin ito at kung mapapansin nyo, sumasama siya sa cursor. Full navigation wheel kasi nasa kanya na lahat. Ang orbit, zoom, pan, rewind, at iba pa. Try natin tong orbit. I-click lang at huwag bibitawan at iikot natin itong drawing. Next, itong zoom. I-click lang at huwag bibitawan. I-zoom in natin at i-zoom out itong drawing. Next, itong pan. Ginagamit ito para hilain ang drawing area. The same lang dito sa iba. I-click lang at huwag bibitawan yun ang function nila. At Itong mga nasa iba ba ng full navigation wheel ay pareho lang ng nasa loob ng full navigation wheel. Pinaghiwahiwalay lang sila. So, alimbawa, itong pan, pag click natin, yung cursor natin ay nakapan mode. At itong orbit, pag click natin, ang cursor natin ay naka-orbit mode. Ngayon, kapag wala itong navigation bar sa drawing area, punta lang tayo sa view at i-click natin itong navigation bar to on or off the navigation bar in the drawing area. Lastly, itong custom visual style. Ginagamit natin ito para palitan yung visual style ng ating drawing. Halimbawa, Gawin natin itong 2D wireframe or conceptual or hidden or realistic or sketchy or shaded with edge or shaded of gray. Or wireframe or x ray. So there we go. I think we're ready to start our 3D exercises. Kaya kung hindi ka pa nakapag subscribe, ay mag subscribe ka na for more CAD learnings.
sa mas marami kong tatanggad lessons, click lang ang subscribe button at notification bell para